Hey everybody, welcome back to Live for Angel. On today, we are checking out something very familiar to everyone. This is the Almost Ryobi new fan. It looks like a drill, but when you turn it on, it cools you off. You're not driving anything. You're not breaking up anything. This is just to cool you off. Now, this is another version of the small compact fans over the summertime, and it has another little trick. It's also a light, so check this thing out. It's got a fan, and it's got a light. Now, whenever the light's on, how you actually turn it on is a little bit different. You gotta press this little button here. And I'm just seeing see my hand, the reflection. You gotta hold it and then you gotta let it go. And then it changes. It's got a few different levels. It's actually not user friendly at all. Alright, so then that's long clicks for the light and then short clicks for the fan. Three different levels of light, three different levels of fan. Super inconvenient in order to use the controls on here, but it's multi-positional, so that's not too bad. But the interesting thing about it is, it has a remote and we can control the different light levels on it and you can control the fan speeds as well. Turn it on, you can turn it off. It even has a timer on this thing. What will they think of next? So this is model number 01F4AKE. Write it down, you'll figure it out. Uh, but I do gotta say, obviously we know that this is not real. We, we know that this is fake, but I think we can learn a couple of good lessons from this. First of all, it has a remote. That's kind of interesting. You don't see this on really any power tool, so it does work actually pretty well. But generally for something like this, you're going to be within arm's distance. You know, it's kind of funny whenever you see designs like this, they really just threw something at the wall to see what stuck and this stuck. Now, the control on this, I mean, it's terrible. It's, it's not good. It's good to turn just the fan on if you really want to. But in order to turn the light on for the push delay, so it's an intermittent delay on this, so you have to hold it for a certain amount. You really do need the remote. But I do like the positions of the heads, that's not bad. And if you need to turn it off from a distance, I guess that's pretty good too. Um, it does actually have real rubber over molding on here. So this is actually rubber, which is kind of cool. But it doesn't look too bad. If you look down in there, um, everything looks in place. Uh, the connections are, are pretty decent. But this is obviously not as quality as what you would see from a major brand like TTI Ryobi. This is just something that somebody put up on Amazon. I saw it. I purchased it because I thought it was funny. And it's actually not that bad. But if you all are interested, I'll put a link down at the bottom. Uh, I'm not saying that I recommend the tool. Um, I'm just saying you can play with it and make your own decision. So I hope that you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Hey, leave a comment. I always respond to them, and I really hope to see you in the next video. Take care, everybody.